Eastern Spotted Skunk. Hi, everybody. My name is Leo. I am a junior ranger, and this is my puppy, Hero. <laughs> I'm playing mini golf. I'm trying to hit the ball with this golf club to get the ball into that hole over there. Okay, here it goes. <laughs> Come on, ball, go in. Oh, yes, it's in. Woohoo! Let's get the ball, Hero. What? Ah, what's this? <laughs> you brought my golf ball back. Thanks. What animal is this? You know what we should do? Let's take a photo and send it to my sister, Katie. She is also a junior ranger. Hi, Katie. I just sent you a photo of an animal we found in the garden. Hi, Leo. I think it's a skunk. So you and Hero should not disturb it, because a skunk that feels threatened will spray something very smelly at you. Really? We'll be careful. Can you find more information about it? No problem, Leo. Great, I'm coming up. Hero, you stay here with our new friend, but don't frighten it. I'll be right back. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's go into the treehouse. Hi, Katie. So what did you find? Hi, Leo. The animal you found is an eastern spotted skunk. It can spray a really smelly liquid at predators to scare them off. But the eastern spotted skunk will warn a predator before spraying. How does it warn a predator? First, the skunk stamps its front paws on the ground. If a predator doesn't leave, the skunk will do a handstand. Then it gets back on all four legs, arches its body, and sprays the smelly liquid. It will take about 10 days before the skunk can spray again. Then we better be careful with the skunk. Yes, we should, Leo. By the way, eastern spotted skunks live in North American prairies and woodlands. Hmm. We should take the skunk there and find it a good home, or it might get too smelly here. Come and join us. Great idea, Leo. See you downstairs. For lots of fun and lots to learn. One, two, off we go. For lots of fun and lots to learn. Ranger Rocky! Hello, Junior Rangers. Ah, I see you have an eastern spotted skunk with you today. Yes, Ranger Rocky. It came out of a hole in our garden. It returned my golf ball. Perhaps the skunk <laughs> thought your golf ball was food. Skunks are scavengers, which means they eat anything they can find. They eat fruit, worms, eggs, leaves, you name it. Their favorite prey, however, are insects and rodents. That is why they can be important for farmers. Eastern spotted skunks eat insects that feed on farmers' crops. They also help farmers get rid of pests, like rats and mice. I didn't know skunks can be so useful. Ranger Rocky, we want to find a suitable home for the skunk. Do you know what we should look for? You should take it to a place with shelter, so a place that protects them from bad weather and danger. Eastern spotted skunks like to live in burrows, tree holes, and hollow logs, and sometimes inside and under buildings. Good luck, Junior Rangers. Thank, Thank you, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. Let's see what we can find. Here is an open field, and on this side is a grassy area with trees and hollow logs. Do you know where we should go? Over there is an open field, and over there is a grassy area with trees and hollow logs. 
So where should we go? There? That's right! We need to go to the grassy area with trees and hollow logs because the trees and logs can be shelter for the eastern spotted skunk. Let's go! Ah! My hat! I'll get it back for you, Leo. Thanks, Katie. <laughs> Katie, there's a coyote on your side. <gasps> nice coyote. Katie! Get away from my sister! At least it got away from Katie. Coyote away! Ew, it stinks! Good work, Skunk. Here you go, Leo. Thanks, Katie. And you too, Skunk. So, what should we look for now? Hello, Junior Rangers! Ranger Rocky! This place may not be safe for the skunk, but a farm could provide food and shelter for it. Farmers like to have skunks around because skunks help get rid of pests. So if you want to find the eastern spotted skunk a home, just look for a small farm. Not for a fire alarm, or a good luck charm, but look for a small farm. I see. So not for a fire alarm or a good luck charm, but, but look, look for, for a, a small, small farm. farm. Thank you, Ranger Rocky. Okay, Hero, to find the eastern spotted skunk a home, you have to look for a small farm. Good luck. Hero, there are a few dots on your radar. One of them might be a small farm. Is that a small farm? Hmm, no, it's a small shed. Let's move on. What's this? It's a house with a nice garden. So definitely not a farm. Let's continue. Is this a small farm? There's a sign. It says, Vegetable farm. It's a vegetable farm. This place could be a good home for the skunk. Great job, Hero. We're coming over. Goodbye, skunk. We did it. We found a home for the eastern spotted skunk. Good work, everybody. Yay! Yay! an eastern spotted skunk in our garden. We learned that skunks spray a very smelly liquid when they feel threatened. We also learned that farmers like to have them around because skunks help get rid of pests. So we found the eastern spotted skunk a new home at a small vegetable farm. Good job, children. You did it. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Mission accomplished! Welcome, fact finders and fun lovers, to the wildlife trivia bonanza that is... Lil Quiz. With me, Quizmaster Wolby. We're going to play a game to see if you know what flies, swims, and hops. Now please give it up for our contestants. Rara, Kokiko, Dill, huh? and me. Welcome, 
contestants, are you ready to wild out with the ultimate game of wildlife trivia? Hmm. Huh? Ah! Today's question is, which animal can only eat while its head is upside down? Let's see if she's right. Sorry, that is incorrect. Your clue is... A group of which animal is called a flamboyance? Option B, a flamingo. That's correct! Did you know flamingos are only pink because of the shrimp in their diet? You've won our grand prize! An otter-led aqua aerobics lesson. We'll be back with another little quiz next time.
It's bubble time! <sighs> huh? Why isn't it working? Because you need soap and water to make bubbles. Anybody got soap? Uh-huh. <laughs> 